What sticks with me is when Father Jeff first explained it. He asked the question to all of us, going, how did you learn how to drive? And I remember quickly saying, well, driver's ed. And then he said, no. He was quick to correct us. And he said, you learn from watching your parents. And he, you know, assimilated that to what we do here in class. And it made a lot of sense. What it really has done is reinforced my own faith going through this and there's many times where we go through these lessons and questions are asked and I'm like hmm you know I went through RCA 20 years ago and I'm like you know I don't know that and that's kind of the fun part of the group dynamic of it as well as we get to sit there and kind of talk through this and a lot of times we pull out the bible and start doing some research to kind of get to the answer it also kind of reinforces the idea of you know my faith being a journey instead of a destination it's continual learning it's as much for me as it is my son really so i was a catechist for five years um, with our old religious formation and one of the things i struggled with is the fact that the kids came and they had a hard time making connections week to week on what we were learning and to kind of helping to build their faith and it was hard for me to communicate with parents what was taking place in religious formation classes every week. And now seeing our faith and family formation classes that we do and parents are involved in the process and are there every time we meet and are responsible for activities at home, I can really see within my own children and the kids with our, in my family groups how much their faith is growing and they're asking questions and they're wanting to learn and they're making connections to things that we've learned in the past. And it's just really amazing to see kind of that change in the way our faith life is growing and it's taking it off the catechist and putting it on to all the adults in the kids' life, not only on um, just the one teacher, but every adult in our family group is responsible for it. And it's great also to grow in our community and get to know more people and to know who, who the adults are that belong to these kids as well. It's just great to, to build our community. I know twice a month I'm going to sit down right next to my kids and be invested in the word and learn their perspective um, coming from their eyes, how they see it, and then be able to have those conversations. Something that I've noticed as well is that because of our commitment twice a month, um, my kids seem to be more open to asking me questions, um, not just during group, but around the dinner table or in the car or just whenever. I like how it's more open instead of like having like one kid go to this class based on like grade, it's the whole family in one group. And it is nice um, having lots of different kids in many different grades being all together. Um, I definitely think that that has helped us grow and see where each other is at as they begin. We started with um, this church a year and a half ago and the the commitment we've made to growing as a family it is such a priority and it's such a neat experience to be able to hear from the kids their perspective of the stories that I grew up learning as well. Initially we came to all CCD classes but a little sporadic as far as coming to mass but then when the family faith formation class started um, things really changed for our family quite a lot. My children pray now every day. We've become closer to people in our faith community. It has been a huge change for us. I've been able to learn a lot of things as a cradle Catholic. I thought I should know, but I actually didn't. I'm really excited to get more involved in the church, and I think that's all because of this family faith formation class. I guess I should say we're a homeschooling family, and so we always did our religious formation at home before. We didn't really see any need to bring our kids to a class. We just thought we could do it as one of our classes at home. But I guess we were just more excited about this because this gave us an opportunity to meet some other families and have the whole family involved in faith formation at the same time. The program itself has had many benefits for our family as well as recognizing it with other families in, in the group. Just really recognizing the conversations that occur between parent and child has been a huge blessing for the families and for us. We also uh, have found that the need for classroom management, dealing with um, behavior issues in the classroom, is not really an issue anymore. And so we, that saves time tremendously on our class time. You've 
taught CCD before and that was always an issue and then we've been leading some of these things and so to have a parent um, with the students in the class is really helpful but from a dad's perspective too I think it's been really awesome to uh, just sit down and like even when it, we were homeschooling and we were doing faith formation at home I would say my wife was doing the lion's share of it because it was part of the school day and so this just gives me an opportunity to have some of those conversations or read some of those scripture verses or go over some of the teachings of the church with my kids and be able to spend that time together with them too so that's been a blessing. And then the relationships that we've developed with the other families in our group has also um, been great. I would say we wouldn't normally have met them on a regular day unless we were going to mass at the same time all the time. With this, we've developed a relationship with three other families last year, and this year we've already added two new families to our parish family and our hearts. It's just been a great way to like increase the number of connections with other families that we have throughout the parish. I think one of my most favorite things is just being able to have me involved with them with the program. So rather than dropping them off for an hour of education, picking them up and saying, you know, hoping they remember what they learned, I can be there. And so now I have an opportunity to know what they've learned and to be able to take it home and throughout the weeks kind of continue that education. Um, even though I grew up Catholic, I felt like I knew a lot. I've learned a ton the last two years. I just I think it's awesome. I also love the sense of community that we've grown. We have attended the parish for about five years, but we don't know a lot of people um, in the parish, so it's really given us the opportunity uh, with our family groups to get to know other people. And it's fun to come to church and see people we know or to do activities outside of church with our family groups and see how different other families practice their faith and how their dynamics are with their kids. My husband and I moved our family here to St. Charles about eight years ago, probably, and we were taking our kids to the weekly religious formation classes, and we kind of used that time as some time to run errands or some time to get things done. So I remember being a little bit concerned when we heard about the new format that was going to be begin. That was until I experienced it. You know, the small groups. The, the groups of families that get together, we have found that we're able to build relationships and connections with others in our faith community. And that's been really great. But above all, I've been able to watch my kids learn and grow in their faith, which has been amazing. I've actually been learning and growing right alongside them, which I did not expect. I know I'm very blessed to be able to be a part of their faith journey. I just didn't realize that they were also going to be a part of mine. We really enjoy the family faith formation. Uh, it's been it's been an opportunity to, to kind of really grow and learn new families and um, grow in faith together. It's really really valuable just to see that connection that's being made at the parent kid level, um, as opposed to kind of the traditional style of like CCD where it's that drop off model. It's been interesting and, and valuable to see the parents really investing the time and investing the sharing their faith stories or uh, their struggles or whatever with their with their children. It's been fun to see families learning together. Mm -hmm. Families that, like, we both grew up in the CCD program and our parents weren't as knowledgeable about the faith as we now can be with our kids and having that journey together and mm -hmm. doing it as a group as opposed to trying to keep up with your kids as they're learning ahead of you. As a dad, I think that's one of the kind of the missing links a lot of the formation in general is just the, the parent, the father role. Um, and seeing our group is especially blessed we have a couple of dads that really are, are active and contributing and very um, very um, valuable members and it's just been great to see that kind of the uh, paternal aspect of it it's empowering families to grow together in their faith and i think that's huge and important and really works toward the future of the catholic faith my experience with the family faith formation groups is a good one i i've really enjoyed it at first i was skeptical um, but it's nice being around other families and being able to share with kids that are the same age as my own. I feel like with that parallel learning and the um, interactive sharing has, has helped them. I feel like they're able to look at other kids and listen to them and get good feedback and it helps them learn that way. They're more likely to share and open up, I think. And it's comfortable having mom and dad right there as well. I think that's helpful, um, a little security item for them. Also, there's uh, some good flexibility with this too in the fact that um, it's once a month, um, our busy everyday lives. It's easier to 
to get there. And we also have one additional time a month that we're able to meet and make that on our own schedules, which is nice. The other thing as a parent I would say is that I feel like I'm almost learning more than my children because our old format with the CCD growing up was way different. And I feel like you just did it because you were supposed to. And the nice thing about this is that I feel like I'm taking home so much more to my family and continuing the faith there in, in our home. Prior to family faith formation, I would say our family was pretty typical with what we were doing in the church as far as participating in Sunday Mass, saying prayers before meals and at bedtime, and our kids were participating in, in CCD. We knew there was a desire there for us to, to build that relationship more within our family, and we started that by just trying to have more conversations with our kids following CCD classes. What are you learning? What's going on? And we would just find that we would get the blank stares. Uh, they were exhausted after a very long day of school. And so in an effort to change that, uh, I started teaching the CCD classes in my classes with our kids and found that I was in a room full of kids who were exhausted and tired. We also were wanting to have connection with families, other families. And what we were finding was that the other families that were dropping their kids off at CCD were just as busy as we were. So it was hard to even connect with other families in that, in that way. We were finding that we really did have a desire that we believe God was placing on our hearts to do more for our children and for our family, to draw closer to him and with each other. We also were putting a lot on the fact that we were busy. Um, we work, we go to school, we do lots of extracurricular activities, and it was easy to get distracted by those things and not put the focus and the emphasis where we wanted it to be. And then I was faced with a lot of questions. Uh, even as a teacher myself, I was asking myself, can I, can I do this? Am I capable? How well do I know my own faith? How much do I recall from my CCD years? We needed the structure and we wanted the support from others around us. I wanted to know what other families were doing. We wanted that connection with other families as well. Participating in family faith formation at St. Charles Borromeo has really been a wonderful hybrid for us. It has allowed us to come together as our family with other families to learn and to grow together. It has given us all an opportunity to have conversations with other families as far as how else are you incorporating God into your home? How are you bringing him into your daily lives? Around the dinner table, around the breakfast table, into the car, uh, driving to and from point A to point B. How can you bring God into your home in the most chaotic times to bring about peace? We most recently visited a residential home for some elderly individuals and the kids made bookmarks with the wonderful people and the residents that live there. And my kids went from, why do we have to do this? To, wow, this is great, when can we come back? For us, it's been an, an evolving process. It's not a 180 overnight. For us, it's been an opportunity to hear how other families are incorporating conversations into their day and how can we in small incremental steps, make it manageable for us to also increase our faith and to increase our conversations that we're having with our children.